Hello boys and girls. Today we're going to start talking about two octave scales. And today we're going to start with our C major two octave scale. Now, in class we have played what we call one octave scales. So say we played a C scale, starting with our three finger C on our G string, and then playing all the way up to our low two on our A string, like so. So C. Then we started talking about the lower octave C major scale, which started all the way down on your big C string, like so. So for a two octave scale, we're just going to take those two scales and we're going to put them together. through this uh, one note at a time and I'm just playing it as normal quarter notes. You can find your C major scales on page 6 of your Essential Elements book. Also on page 44 is a list of a whole bunch of scales including your C major. So we're going to start with C string, one finger D, two fingers E, three fingers F natural, G string, one finger A, two fingers B, three fingers C, then our D string, one finger E. Now we have to use a low two because we're playing F natural, so make sure your second finger is touching first finger. Regular third finger G on your third tape. A string, one finger B. And again, low two for C natural. Back down C, B, A, G, F natural, low two. C, then make sure you use a nice regular two, high two for B natural, A, G, F, E, D, and C. So now we're going to try it with our bow. So again, I'm just going to play it as, as straight quarter notes. So first one note at a time, G, um, C, then D, E, F. Go to your G string, A, B, C, D, E, F natural, low two, G, A string, B, low two, C. And back down, C, B, A, go three fingers on D string, G, low two, F, E, D, Three fingers C, B, A, G, three fingers F, two for E, one for D, and C. Now all together. C major scale. So two octave scales are a really important skill to learn, especially going into middle school. A lot of teachers are going to want to know how many octaves of scales you can perform. And C major is a really easy one to play two octaves on viola, so it's a good one to start with. So I would practice working on that one, and then we'll move on to some of the harder ones later.